We're rolling. You'll sip you that. I do. Okay. Who oh. wants to start, Johnny? Welcome I'm to World right Genius, now. the TV show, episode four hundred and twenty. <laughs> nice. Because it was four twenty yesterday. I remember. Um, yeah, I was the there. Time I, we were I had recording. a breakdown on four twenty. Oh, really? You did? Yeah. I, what happened? What happened? I was streaming Street League for seven hours, uh, and then it was like. There was it was a point where I'd been going for seven hours, and then there was like thirty minutes until the next thing, and then I stopped the stream to take a break, and then I was like, I can't go back. Mm -hmm. But that was like the finals, so I was like streaming for seven hours to get to the finish line, and then at the finish line, I like you passed out pretty much. I couldn't yeah, do it. Yeah, I don't think breaks are really off. every time. This used to be our fatal flaw with the podcast, where we'd take a break after like an hour, we'd go in the backyard play football catch. And then we'd come back in, <laughs> and we'd be like, I don't want to do this anymore. Let's go play more catch. We were playing football throw as well. Yeah. We're nice. Throw and catching. Thanks, man. This is good. <laughs> this is <laughs> good. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> you play the intro, Andrew. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> You gotta let it ride, man. Yeah, there's Where's no Andrew's reset mic? on that Andrew, one. Do you have I don't your mic think. over there? You're not mic'd up. No. He's Where's not. Andrew's you, mic? You can bro? always. I don't know. I did. I didn't know he was coming today. I didn't either. I was pretending to be dead in my bed, and really, and, and then Andrew came in. I thought I was gonna be one of you guys. Oh. So I was the one that was surprised, not him. Uh, <laughs> yeah, he didn't know I was gonna be. Oh uh, yeah, dead, I forget. Andrew's possum. here. It's been a while since Andrew's been yeah, here. Andrew. Welcome back, Andrew. Nice Can you to play have some you. Cheering, maybe. Woo, uh, he, Andrew. Yeah. Um, fucking fuck me, man. Uh, fun fact: this happened to me today. Uh, I don't. This is just gonna be a, a little tip. Everybody, if you if you have a choice between doing something the way that you always do it and doing it a little bit differently, take it from me. You should do it a little bit differently because today, <laughs> I go to Seven Leaves. Mm -hmm. Uh, the boba boba place and mm -hmm. every time I go into the drive through because they have a drive through mm -hmm. and it's just kind of easier mm -hmm. um, but I've been a little depressed so there were three cars in the drive through I was like you know what I'm gonna go inside and make a and maybe make a little bit of a human connection with somebody <laughs> who knows you know maybe me and the person at seven leaves working there. <laughs> Maybe we're going to, like... I used to sometimes see hot chicks when I'd go into places. Well, <laughs> back when you'd go into places. I wasn't even thinking of hot chicks, but craziest shit happens. I go in, and who do I see? CJ. Who's CJ? I didn't know who CJ <laughs> was either until he goes, Oh, shit, what up to me? And I was like, what? I was like, hey, man, how's it going? He said, love your videos. And I was like, fuck yeah, I'm about to score a free drink. Uh -huh. Did get a free drink. Nice, And I was man. like, oh, so do you skate? And he's like, no, I surf. So I met CJ the surfer who works at Seven Leaves. Wow. And he gave me a free drink. So moral of the story is go inside Seven Leaves. If instead you're famous of on YouTube and someone might recognize you. And yeah. Then, mm -hmm. or, just, or just do yeah. it because... Nobody does it anymore. Nobody goes inside Seven Leaves anymore. No, no one does. I had to go to a coffee <laughs> shop today, and you I had to. I felt sad that because in New York, I worked right across the street from a coffee place, and I had a rapport with the barista. You had a you had like a three hundred dollar a month subscription. Kind to of a coffee shop. Yeah, but yeah. they would hook it up. They'd give me all sorts of free things. Nice. Um, oh, I went to that one with you. Yeah, 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 it was chill. It was weird. It was like way further than I thought it would be from your house. Oh no, no, not that one. Um, this was across the street from my oh, okay, tattoo shop. But this, the the one that I went to today is gonna have to be the coffee shop that I go to. It's the closest one. Uh oh, is it not good? I just don't have any connection with the baristas. Really? Or, what were they like? Um, just kind of regular ass yeah. coffee shop people, you yeah. know. But not like What were they playing in there? What music were they playing? I in don't there? even remember. You don't remember? Uh-uh. I was mm -hmm. just, It must have been really inconsequential. That's probably then. a good thing cuz 
a lot of coffee shops you go into and you just hate everything that's going on. I did hate it. Very memorable. I hated it. The a one lot we go to reason. over here, like Johnny's favorite coffee shop here, what it's is Frank it called? Ocean themed. What is it oh, called? I, it's strictly coffee based that yeah, I but like what, it. What is it called? It's called though? Contra. Yeah, Contra. The worst vibe it's in so the world. It's so stupid in it's there. It's 2015 Frank Ocean. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's weird that that still works on like college chicks. It though. does. It does. Like Chapman girl, like it's oh, so crowded all the time. Like plastic furniture, then like a, the, a rug that's like a spiral. Orange. Or yeah, it's like an <laughs> white and orange. Like an yeah, orange white and sofa. orange. Oh my god. Yeah, it's really bad in there. Mm, but yeah. God damn that Vietnamese iced coffee they got coffee. is so sick. I hate. I hate it in there. It's. It's like I, I hate how they decided it was a place to hang out. Also, yeah. The best part about that place is that you illegally park in like a mm-hmm. towaway spot, and then you just go in there and you're like, "I need to get the fuck out of here," <laughs> and that's how you already feel anyway. So it's just, it all works out. Yeah, it works out. That there's. A couple of unsettling vibe coffee shops in the Orange Circle area. Oh yeah, the one, uh, the one in the bank building yeah. is weird. It's like a they basically just imagine a, that thing. A gigantic, like super high ceiling. It's a nice location. Old, old, old bank yep. building. Yep. It's like a historic building. Marble floors, like yeah. Rick Ross's house in there. And they and they just the bank has been empty for years. Yep. And they just installed like a ikea coffee yeah. shop it, it looks like if you bought a coffee shop on ikea it's, <laughs> it's at ikea it's bizarre it's like a square structure fake modern square structure inside so it's, this it's a historic, modular coffee shop yeah inside of a historic bank building it's bizarre yeah. and yeah. freaky you can get a matcha latte they'll, there though they're like cockroaches That's they'll true. go anywhere the modular the coffee, coffee shop? shops? Yeah, they will. They will, in my mind. All right, let, mm-hmm. let's get to my topic. I think I just got my... It's not on the Tady list, sorry. I, I didn't get my... I set a reminder for my topic, and I don't see it. <laughs> oh, horny R&B. Yeah, I'm just weird. Okay, Song. so... I think this is a maybe part of a greater phenomenon, but sometimes there will be music playing somewhere that you are, and it just seems like way inappropriate to the point where like people just don't kind of listen mm-hmm. to the lyrics of songs anymore and this is a pet peeve of mine like outside of a public context but i was in the climbing gym and this song comes on that's one of those r&b songs about love making a dude talking and mm-hmm. then like and the dude will be like oh yeah like yeah, we used to fuck like, and I don't really have feelings for you like that anymore. But I'll still give you dick whenever. Like that's literally what he was saying in the song. Mm-hmm. And then the chick like pipes in like a like a fairy coming down out of the top of the screen and is like, boy, you know what? I'm... And it's like some weird like sexual ass like tug of war in an R and B song. And there's like kids like climbing <laughs> on the rock walls. And, and I was like, if I was a parent, like. Even if the kids have no idea what's happening because they don't listen to what the music is about, it's just like a bizarre fucking choice. And I don't like that music anyway, mm-hmm. like a like flirting sex R and B between like if there's one, it's a one person performance. Like if it's a The Weeknd song mm-hmm. or something, I don't mind it as much if it's just his side. But when there's like a conversation, it somehow makes it worse. It's, it, it, well, it makes it real almost. I, I just don't like the idea of like the performance in the studio of like and then it feels like an intrusion. That's what it. That's why because it feels like I shouldn't be hearing about like these Their two people flirting. Yeah, I, th- I think like Karen's kind of gave up on complaining about music. For they some shouldn't reason. have. That's one they should. Like that was with. the war. They they just kind of folded on that one for some reason. Like, I, was, my mom, <laughs> I was about to. I say haven't heard something. my mom really complain about anything that's been. Playing in like the actually I don't really go out with my mom that much that might be the problem, <laughs> but uh, I can't imagine her complaining about music anymore. But I think the 10 standard years ago she probably would have said something. The standard is way lower now. I think for like what is publicly acceptable, mm-hmm. you know, like there's uncensored rap music in retail stores and such. Well, rap became the number one genre, and. Yeah, I think just that. I don't want I don't want to hear like expletive, and especially sexual. I don't want to hear about 
Like, the other thing is, like, at a gym, too, they won't play, like, even the premiere shit. It's, like, the third string, like, D-tier musical, like, spoof genre stuff. So it's, like, a fucking random R&B scrub, like, bragging about his, his dick or whatever. And I'm just like, I don't kn- I don't believe you or <laughs> care about this unnamed R&B sex. I don't give a that fuck. That is very weird. Like, you better be... Like, to get past the ox, and you know the guy. I'll that, listen to Usher. The guy that made the playlist. You. He's like looking around, like everybody loves this. I'm playing it right now, and <laughs> the kids are having fun, and <laughs> the Wait, vibes a, in here are immaculate right now. They weren't. I R&B noticed that cuts. guy should be in jail. I fucking yeah, noticed, you man. Complain. You should complain. Most people you should, should call. complain. That guy will get his ox stripping from him. I would like that. Mm-hmm. That I would, would like be that. awesome. You guys remember that song, uh, Promiscuous? Yeah, Promiscuous. Yes. Yeah, that, that Promiscu- yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. I just got a weird memory. Uh, my mom used to listen to, like, Kiss FM, <laughs> but she didn't, like, understand because she's Chinese. But w- that song used to come on. Mm. I used to sit in the back, and I, could, uh, I would get, like, a boner. <laughs> <laughs> I would sit in the back of a car with a boner. <laughs> <laughs> my Kiss uh, FM oh gave my Andrew God. a boner. Okay, that was one of the craziest Dude, things I've ever heard of. Kids, kids Did, don't, wait, wait, kids don't set, get music re- boners anymore. Oh They're desensitized, God. man. Wait, Andrew doesn't have a microphone. <laughs> no, they can hear it. They can definitely oh hear it. Oh, my yeah. God. They can hear it. That's they can insane. Hear. You that is so cool. Music? Yeah, yeah, my story music. sucks. Dude, now. there's too much iPad porn now. You yeah, can't get music boners anymore. Back in the day, it didn't take much. I remember the... The Mariah Carey video, the diss track on Eminem. Oh my God! Yeah, I was like, this is the hottest thing I've ever mm-hmm. seen. Yeah, kids got to I mean, be so desensitized now with just watching Ice Spice music videos. All oh day. my God! Well, also, just oh TikTok, my God! Every social media platform will like, if you engage with anything horny, it will just flood your uh, recommended with horny content. I haven't noticed. I feel like it's. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like it's. Uh, it like defaults to horny stuff too. Yeah. If you make a fresh <laughs> IG account, it'll be like, it's considered a normal <laughs> interest like a grid now. Of stuff and then one of them will be horny. Well, You're like, what is this? Yeah, it's What's like going on over here. It's like the if you, I don't know. It's like you starting out with your like initial like preferences in a video game mm-hmm. or whatever. Like Instagram, be like, here's interior design, like. Here's like cooking. Here's like a girl like working out like with her ass like you know in front of the camera, and then like here's stuff about movies. You know, it's just Mm -hmm. like one of the five basic Mm -hmm. like things Instagram has to. And I guess that's they probably make a lot of money off of showing you that uh, sexual preferences. They really. I think I remember the. Do you guys remember the first sexual image that you ever saw? I remember the first one I saw. Wow. Like the first I, I pair of boobs I ever saw. Uh, I don't know. The first time I watched porn was with all my friends at a sleepover. I think that's really? how we all did it. Yeah. Wow. Oh, you did it on your own? Uh, I I uh I went on. F- uh, well, I don't can't remember if I if I when I saw it. The first time I ever saw a pair of boobs was in a magazine, but it was like I don't know what magazine it was. At the end of the magazine, there were like ads. Yeah. And I think yeah. there was some kind of like strip club uh, ad or something. I don't know if it was it was maybe line. like escortish kind of mm-hmm. and there was a Asian lady, Filipino maybe, mm-hmm. and she had like ultra fake boobs and I was like, "What is this?" <laughs> and that was the first one I ever saw and then nice. later on I went on fuck.com, not the same day, but I used to type fuck.com in <laughs> and my sister's friend told on me who wanted me to do it. She oh, said, go, wow. like, type in fuck.com, yeah. and then, like, a naked lady came up, and she went to go tell on yeah, me. Yeah, wow, I got grounded bitch. for yeah, looking at, uh, like, bikini, typing, like, bikini girls <laughs> and all that jazz. I go- <laughs> yeah, got, I think I Googled boobs. No, I was actually with, like, one of my friends what? that was, like, a, a girl, like a childhood friend that was a girl, and we were just, you know, typing in all the bad words we could think of. Like, bikini. <laughs> And her parents were strict, so they like went through her history and uh, found it. And I don't think it was actually grounded, but I would just yeah. say that'd be fucked up. I feel like that's really messed up to ground a kid for looking up bikini or or <laughs> boobs or anything. Yeah, so I was like it's a to, normal thing to do. That's why I had to like watch Mariah Carey and 
Katy Perry music videos. <laughs> calling your searches. It's a lot of Mariah Carey <laughs> in your search history calling it. It's the same video. You yeah. must really like that song. Yeah. Uh. I got caught uh, by my parents because I was using the family computer for two months. And I didn't, I was in fourth grade. So I didn't know how to like clear the history. Mm. So my dad went on and it was like askmen.com slash boob. <laughs> <laughs> like, Hot girl boob. Like, Hot girl boob. <laughs> that's so where cool. the, that's where that's where it all starts. Hot girl boob. <laughs> that's how. And my mom found it and she told my whole family. Oh yeah. my so god. The next time I saw my aunts, like, so Andy. You you hot like you boob. like hot girl boob, Andy? <laughs> hot what? girl boob. I just just out of curiosity. <laughs> what uh, what comes up? Hot girl boob. I'd like to see you the really? results. Hot girl boob. Maybe maybe people just get too specific these days. Oh, what the hell is that? Let me see. Is that the top result? Let me see. It's mm, filtered. Nah. There's, there's uh, filters. I'm not feeling her. There's filters on here. Nah, it's not very hot okay, girl boob. Go. What the hell? This is like straight up AI generated. What the fuck? Hot did girl boob is not as good as it they, was when I was dude, a kid. They, I'll tell you that. <laughs> they, they put like an infant's face on a set of like quadruple Ds. Yeah, That's when, when, fucking not back cool. Back in my man. day, hot girl boob was You'd way see something better. good. Yeah. Yeah, you'd see something authentic. Yeah, I, I Googled you boob. To, no. Sorry, go ahead. I Googled, <laughs> I Googled boob or boobs and the first site that came up was called Jug World. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> it's just like a a web page with just like a almost like an Instagram now style like uh just tiles of, of yeah. just moves. Jug you world. Can click on a jug world. <laughs> it was really cool. Can we title this one Jug World? <laughs> um it was, it was like, almost like an world. Instagram. They, yeah. I think they, Jug World wow, created they, they popularized the, the grid. Instagram format. Yeah, the, yeah, if I remember dudes, correctly, Jug you fans. can Google image search anything and just take off all the safety Safe search. searches and just scroll and you'd see some boobs. You'd see anything. You'd see poop, <laughs> boobs. <laughs> <laughs> just random crazy... Sh <laughs> no, I wasn't Googling no, poop. It just came. <laughs> Don't you remember that? Like, there would just be pictures of shit. Like, that I don't felt... think I ever had that technique. Where I, where you I don't remember, where I John, type Do you in remember like, Googling no. stuff and there would just be pictures no. of, like, poop? Uh, no, no. You type in, like, Doberman and you keep scrolling until you get boobs on there? Is that yeah, what you're you saying? could back in the day. Yeah, you could. I'm telling you. No. Uh oh, man. Poop no. and boobs. Holy uh, shit, oh, man. Wow. That's oh, yeah, I funny. swear to God, there was just pictures of poop on Google Images back in the day. <laughs> yeah, you wouldn't get that anymore unless you're really searching for it. Oh, yeah, they've nerfed Google. <sighs> what else? made uh, everything else so, corny. Johnny? We were talking about how you're kind of Karen-like in your music thing now. Yeah. Pussing I'm kind of, I kind of had a... Oh, wait. Uh, can, before we, I just have to get this on my chest, off my chest before on, I. On, he wants to get it on okay. his chest. Okay, shit. We were talking, poop, sorry, poop on the brain. People shit in the boobs. comments think that I'm like an actual, like, diehard Drake fan. And I've got this on Instagram too, because I post on my story, I'll be like, Team Drake. Mm -hmm. And I've got DMs for people that get legitimately angry. They're like, you fucking idiot. I'm like, what? It's a joke. Like, you know, it's not like I actually care about this rap beat. You do listen and, to a lot of Drake. Okay, now. I do listen, but it's not like I actually think yeah. that Drake is like a, has more artistic mastery than yeah. Kendrick Lamar. There's a comment that got like eight upvotes on the last video saying my music taste was trash, which maybe it is. They'll but say that about anybody. Not for the, not because I actually like claim that drake is a superior artist to kendrick lamar i just want to get that clear some of you guys can't tell that i'm joking okay about liking drake that i seriously really like but i'm self-aware about yeah. liking drake no, okay it's like a lifestyle it's a lifestyle thank you anyway sorry i had to do that yeah now uh, we can do the show i went i went surfing before work today <laughs> and wow. i was going out on the beach and when you get out to the beach you're kind of looking at the waves. You're kind of 
There's a couple different breaks. You you're can sizing go to. up the waves, and yeah, you're like, I'm, I'm intermediate. Like, oh, and that wanna, looks like a, an advanced wave. I want to go over. The, <laughs> I'm going to go over there. <laughs> but there's these two guys <laughs> that were standing out there, like just watching me look <laughs> <Really>? <laughs> out. <laughs> and and I, I so I start walking. I'm walking by them. He goes, "Excuse me, what what, were, what are you looking for?" <laughs> <laughs> what is it was it like a regular dude it was two two guys just dressed n- like normally okay um and and i was like oh like i'm just seeing Sharks. where i want to that's i was gonna say that i i thought about that later i thought that would be a really funny thing to say oh yeah there's a bunch of sharks over there mm-hmm. so i'm gonna go over 6 there 6 p.m so the sharks should be in <laughs> huntington right now <laughs> but uh i i didn't say that i i was just explained like oh d- different breaks and depending on the time of day mm. break in different zones i'm trying to see where i want to paddle out um and he's like oh okay can you say, can you say that one more time and then he pulls out his phone and starts recording me and usually i'm not i'm not like I, I really like what uh, was, he, those was this like videos. a stolen valor thing? He's like this guy's pretending to be a surfer. No, and he's not. I I don't know if he just found it interesting or was maybe planning he on was, surfing one day. Dude, it sounds like he was visiting from somewhere or something. He, yeah, I, that would have been clutch know. if you did it for him. I I did. I just repeated it. <laughs> wow. But but was it was clutch. like a weird thing where he didn't like. He's like, oh, can I like film it and. He's and then goes, he didn't and explain what? why he yeah, needed what, to film why? Yeah, no. You didn't ask him? No, it was very a weird scenario. That's what uh, was the like, other dude doing? He was looking interested in what I had to say. <laughs> but he didn't what, say anything. What are these this? guys like figuring out like if they should buy the ocean or not? No, to Maybe, me this is like a, a camera just came out and some guy has one and he's like, oh, I should film this. But I, I, I don't this. care if people film me. But in that moment, I was like, you know, I really wish he kind of asked permission before, you know? He did. No, he didn't ask permission you to said, film it. You said, can I, can I film this early? You, you were quoting him and you said that. But maybe he didn't say that, actually. Uh, did I say that? I th- can I record it? That's what you said. You oh, made really? it sound like he said, no, I one said more time, but that. this time with my phone yeah, on your did face. Not, he didn't say, oh. can I record? That was the weird part. He didn't say, can I, would I record just, this or anything? Oh, he just said, can you, can you repeat that? You should have asked him, Johnny. You shouldn't have let him it. record you like that. You should have asked him. Why? Why are you recording me? Why do you sir? want to record me? It all happened so fast. Cause he what? Yeah, I, I get that. I get that. But what the now? Cause now I really want to know what he was gonna. And where? Cause it, it's such a where it's ended up. It was yeah. It's such a like nothing thing, you know. Thing Especially of. if you don't surf or you're not planning on learning to surf. Cause well, the reason I say <laughs> yeah. it sounds like he's visiting is it sounds like he. Like maybe wants to send a video to his family or something and be like, oh, I ran into this guy at the beach who was, Surfing. you know, staring at the waves and we were like, we were wondering what he was seeing because yeah. we're from North Carolina and we don't surf. Yeah, maybe you like look like a surfer guy. He just like the whole thing. Yeah, maybe you look nice and exotic. He's like, that to him. was so cool what you just said. I need to capture this and keep it forever. Maybe. For a myself. guy we know used to ask us to redo things that yeah, he thought was funny because he, he was crazy. MP. He would, yeah, he would start yeah. writing down things we were saying. He'd be like, be like high in a that's jacuzzi. So right, scary. Yeah. I think we've talked about this before, yeah. but you, you'd say some just random thought that would make people laugh, and then he'd be like, can you say that again? He'd be like, dude, you're killing the fucking vibe right now, bro. Like, yeah. Trying to be that is, there's no way to some make Some Indian a- food smell just came through the vents. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty powerful. <laughs> Well, it smells like curry in here. Johnny's like hiding a body. <laughs> it's an Indian guy <laughs> in my closet. Yeah, maybe. Okay. Um, uh, what were we saying? Uh, you were talking about that weird, catch. weird story. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, I just. It's weird. It's so strong. That is crazy. What's she must Ash must be cooking in there. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Something spicy. Yeah. Anyway, what what else we got on the to do list, man? Um, Give me some mo. I wrote down some things. What did you write down, Colin? 
what truck are you? Oh yeah, let's do this. this is kind of a uh, a random. We didn't prepare for this episode very hard because we did one midweek. That was yeah. We did, did one we, on Wednesday. What was the one we did on midweek? We didn't do, upload that one yet, right? Andrew was gone. No, okay. that one. You have work. our Patreon episode to edit too. Did you put that in the drive? Pretty sure. I'll do it. You're gonna like that one, I think. You're gonna like. We that have a one. lot of content, guys. Is Johnny and I unleashed. Yeah. It was much more like you know complexly problematic than Not just really. saying it's, our word. Is Pretty straightforward. Uh, okay, well, there were multiple instances of problematic behavior then. Yeah, pretty you know. straight, straightforward problematic. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. I wasn't there for this one. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, tune in. We'll put it on screen. Um, anyway. <laughs> Fuck. Yeah. And if you screen record it, we can sue you mm -hmm. per it's Patreon true. rules, right? Uh, yeah, I've, I've only ever, like, removed one thing, but... Wow. Yeah. In my... We're gonna go with that. <laughs> um, are we do, are we doing truck? Which truck are you? Well, Chris? I feel like it's too early to do yeah, trucks. Let's not do that. Okay. Let's do that at the end. Computer. We do the visual stuff at um, the end. I keep getting ads for Jackson chains. Oh God! And it seems like that name they should have um, because it sounds like jacks off. Yes, it does. And it and it's a bunch of dudes like. Who would never like think, it was think funny that way? All, they would all. never think because they're all just like with chains, like black t-shirt and ch Colin. You should get one, a Jackson. You're chain. a Jackson potential buyer. Have you seen them, Colin? Ryan Sheckler, P. Rod. They're all wearing these yeah. jack off chains. Interesting. But it seems like for me that would be the first thing that I said. You, you can't name. We can't mm. have the name be, if I was a part of it whatsoever. Can't call it Jacks on. Can't call it Jacks on. The kids will be calling it Jacks off mm -hmm. in no time. Can we get Ryan Sheckler Jacks off? Yeah, Ryan Sheckler Jack off chain. <laughs> um, yeah. got a good ad for that. Though. That's a good one. You gotta bring it. Hit me with some mo heat. Dog. All right, all right, all right. Chase sent me a, a very fake JFK quote um, <laughs> that I would like to read. Uh, <laughs> That's so good. It, That's he sent me this as like like some sort of proof to some sort of conspiracy theory mm. or something. He's just admitting he it. They would overthrow Trump. We put it's, ten thousand uh, okay. tons of nuclear waste inside Mount Fuji. First of all, this is what it looks like. I'll screenshot and send it to you. But this is where the the what the, the fuck? this is a JFK quote apparently. But looks, it's like looks good. Who to me. posted looks that? Looks like some random. I just like a Google Word doc. Yeah, yeah. He looks yeah, it like looks he like typed they used the underlined feature typos. to make it look like it was a. Uh, it has typos. Mm. It has all sorts of. It did have a lot of typos in formatting. Here, here it goes. The this is a JFK quote. Deep underground military bases were connected with advanced tunnels and to underground cities. <laughs> <laughs> where they housed cloning facilities where humans were bred in captivity. This is literally the new Fallout show. Harvesting them for their pineal glands and adrenochrome. <laughs> A complex underworld with facilities designed for their evil purposes mm -hmm. tied into trafficking. Where do 8 million children go missing yearly? <laughs> what? One of these hub entrances was at Epstein Island, where oh, they were please. used. <laughs> Epstein's where, great grandfather. Where they used their if project the, if they had MK access Ultras to a, a bungalow with eight million children in it. Why would he be flying children from not the bungalow into the island? I don't know. Where they used their so eight project million kids MK go Ultras. Missing? I. That's a question in this. There's a question mark. Afterwards. Why do? Where do eight million <laughs> children who go missing go each yeah, year? Yeah, if not underground. <laughs> All right. Continued. Uh, um, they They're use clearly not on the surface. Okay. You don't want to hear the rest of it. I do. I I'm, do. Please. You know what? Please, I want to hear the rest of it. No. Please. please. Colin wanted to interrupt. Colin wants to hear it I didn't too. Interrupt. We're just having fun, Johnny. You're actually insane all right you're out, out of your mind just having a good time 
All right. One of these hub entrances was at Epstein Island where they use their Project MK Ultras and blackmail recordings of their torture. Blackmail recordings? Yep. Of them doing what? Playing basketball? <laughs> Having their way with the 8 million missing children. <laughs> no, I don't think anybody. I, you I can, got it. Okay. Behind their, the veil were the reptilians and greys controlling their nano strings between quantum realities. Cloning facilities underground were used in their galactic slave ships and off world trafficking. <laughs> The deeper we go, the more unrealistic it all becomes. John F. <laughs> John F. Kennedy, 19th, 19th vice president. What? <laughs> yeah. Wait, they didn't even give him John this like, full prompt? And he believed it? Was and then the, the next slide is save this, and there's some weird... Oh, it's um, a Google satellite image of uh, a, yeah, some an weird island stuff going something. on. Okay. This... Guy, have you been on this guy's profile yet? Yes, I yeah, dude. I conspiracy have. theorists have the most vivid imagination, and but, I think that's cool. Yeah, oh, yeah, it's totally no, that's insane. A troll, but yeah, you think that's oh, a troll? But no, there's people in the comments that don't think it's a troll. No, that's yeah, but definitely that's why it's a troll. I don't think that's a troll. I think that there are things no. that exist that people genuinely believe in that no, are I'm absurd. No, I'm saying somebody, whoever wrote that, is trolling. And I, don't, then I don't think The fact trolling. that people in the comments believe it means... That no, I, do, no, the, I think the I don't whole think thing is, is sincere, probably. So you just... How did he get that JFK quote, then, if you're not trolling? It might have come to him in a DMT <laughs> vision. You know, he might have been imagining JFK He's saying like, it, this so, or someone actually. did. Maybe the maybe the original author just put this out, yeah, in a schizophrenic episode or something. Someone goes, "The fuck, you deserve way more credit with your knowledge." <laughs> <laughs> it's just put it on, put it on Instagram, and then signed JFK. We should, so insane. We should get that guy on the podcast. The average person probably does not question anything if there is a quote attached to the end of it. I would also, imagine JFK was he the, was a president. Yeah, I don't know why 35th. it says. I don't know why it says. <laughs> Vice president, nineteenth <laughs> vice president. I, I, I <laughs> was he? He was he a vice president? Also, I don't know my history very well. I, I don't know, but he, it's just it funny be. if somebody was a president and a vice president to credit them with being a vice president. Unless at the time of the, the statement, maybe it's oh, you know what it is. I think is when you add minor details that are like inconsequential to the story overall, but they make it seem like. It's real. It's like, mm -hmm. oh, it's too specific to be real. Maybe at the time that he said that, he was a vice president. Maybe he was the vice president of the intergalactic uh, <laughs> oh, okay. government. The intergalactic government. Uh -huh. Yeah. What the fuck? Yeah, wow, crazy. man. Yeah. What the fuck? Did I ever tell you guys about uh, my mom's conspiracy theories? No. Is she sometimes... Is her cons... Yeah. Oh, sorry, what? No, they're, they're crazy. Sometimes she, like, skits up posts in, like, group chat with me and Amy. That's mm -hmm. cool. And there's this one... You know the conspiracy that uh, Michelle Obama's trans? A man, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. She, it, she Michael started, Obama? Yeah, she started to get... <laughs> so, like, this is out of the blue after, like, two months of not texting. She was like, so a lot of people think that. But the question is, where did the kids come from? It's... Yeah. She's a man, but Obama actually had children with his mom, Michelle's mom. Oh. And now they're playing a facade to make sure, like the got it. Makes sense. That sounds way harder than just. Oh, Getting wouldn't, wouldn't getting they be a, worried a, about a like woman. if you had a kid with your mom, like the kids being all whack? No, the uh, Michelle Obama's mom. Oh, yeah, Michelle yeah. Obama's mom. Yeah, that's interesting. Gender, Michael. Michael? Yeah, <laughs> Fuck, dude, how did you not guys laugh at my black male joke? Uh, like from a while ago? no, right yeah. now, Johnny said in yeah. the caves they have blackmail recordings, and I said of them doing what playing basketball. <laughs> <laughs> no one laughed. <laughs> Wasn't there a joke a couple months ago that was like, you got blackmailed and someone thought it was actually blackmail? 
<laughs> you got blackmailed. <laughs> that would be cool if you were a black guy after you smashed and go, you just got blackmailed. <laughs> we can cut that all of that out, but or we can leave it in. <laughs> it doesn't matter. That would that would be cool. I would do it if I could. Yeah. We watched um Kanye has a line about that, I think, about oh, they tried to blackball me. They forgot about two things, my black balls. Yep. That was cool. Yeah, that was badass when he said that. Yeah, I agree. We still fuck with Kanye on this podcast. <laughs> we don't shy away from a little controversy on this podcast. All right. Sorry, your turn, Johnny. You guys think I'm going to get you in trouble, don't you? Stop playing with your cup. Okay, well, make, say something interesting. We're so just I'm in- interested because you're the one that usually has a problem with things getting... No way! Is he not the biggest baby when it comes to getting in trouble? Yeah, because you fucking made us all like a uh, condition dust. Okay, to, well, uh, now I don't care anymore, so okay, let it uh, rip. Then I'll have to get... Yeah, it's like I'm like a dog that got hit. I go, oh, Joe's going to not like this <laughs> a dog one. dog that got hit. Also, I'm the only... I, I say things because I'm the only one that... Uh, or you do now, but Johnny doesn't listen to it and give Andrew uh, show notes. Yeah, yeah, that's true. That was your responsibility for a while. Yeah. So I would you never know to... when there's going to be an episode of you saying the R word seven times in a row. Yeah. So it happens. It happened to me <laughs> <laughs> recently. <laughs> and in the uh, comments, people are like, Joe would blame Andrew for him <laughs> saying the R word a bunch of times. Uh, <laughs> Colin does, um, I think he doesn't take out things where he's. Uh, says anything naughty he takes out things where he just doesn't doesn't like it he he did he doesn't like the feeling well yeah man this one joke on the first of the second season it was that homeless joke do you remember it that was the first episode oh no what did we do no colin said something so fucking funny yeah i made a funny what was it about I think I said that the trolleys they're making in Santa Ana was like anti-homeless architecture or something. The like trolleys? That. Oh, <laughs> oh, the trolley they're installing. Yeah, oh. I said it was to combat the homelessness issue or something. <laughs> and Joe, you guys made me remove it. Man, we should. I wish we didn't. <laughs> And we do talk about homeless people all the time, though. I was even today. I I was cu- coming off the freeway, and a homeless guy was staring at me like so hard, and it like didn't make me want to give him anything. I didn't have anything to give him anyway because I we talked where, about this. Where was it? Pay with uh just off Seventeenth Street. Mm. Just everybody pays with Apple Pay now, so I didn't have anything to give him either way. But it was like he was like looking at me like he was angry with me. I was like, I don't. This isn't, you're not going to win. Like, you should be juggling <laughs> or something. <laughs> There's a guy that juggles in L.A. and people give him money all the oh, time. Oh, yeah, I know that you guy. You know the guy, yeah, he, gets, yeah. he gets in the middle of the road and he starts yeah, juggling. Imagine juggling being, too. like, really just, you've been homeless just for so 20 homeless. years. And somebody's like, pick up juggling. <laughs> well, if you've been homeless for 20 years, he needs to fucking change <laughs> something should, up. Yeah. You should keep um, yeah, you can't keep li- doing little the same baggies thing. of juggling like a little pamphlet that teaches yeah. you how to juggle like here give five dollars that's not gonna do much for you my juggling teach, pamphlet teach a man teach, how to teach fish, a yeah. man how to juggle <laughs> teach a homeless guy how to give juggle. a homeless guy a dollar and you give him meth for a day teach him how to juggle <laughs> <He'll> be, <laughs> he's, set he's for tweaking life. forever yeah, he'll be high forever tweaking forever tweaking for life <laughs> <laughs> so yeah uh, next time I'll do that, I'll, I'll, I'll carry around a... Oh, I should have given him my air conditioner that's in the back of my car. <laughs> this big, big air conditioner on wheels. I should have given him that. Yeah. Wow, that's cool. Yeah, I'm sorry. Sorry for talking about homeless people again, but that's uh, that happened today. So what, happened, that's what happens when you live in Gavin Newsom's California. Oh, my God. Fucking scumbag you, Gavin you Newsom. You talk about homeless people. We hate Gavin Newsom here. Gavin Newsom's a greedy fuck. What's he doing with all my money? That's what I want to know. I want a fucking itemized list. I'll tell of, you what he's doing with Tell me what dude. he's doing with my money, Colin. So, I don't. Re- I I don't want to like talk shit. I do that directly because it's <laughs> on my Gavin field of Newsom. Work. No, oh. but dude, like, these school listening. districts have like I've been working at school districts. They have 
like billions of dollars in taxpayer money and they just fucking shovel it onto the fucking furnace. Like they don't do shit. They just they're not paying so the teachers. That's for sure. And it's like a massive bureaucracy where there's all these political people. And you see it from the inside, huh? Yeah, they're all doing fucking nothing. Yeah. It's, it's and then they're also building homeless shelters. So they're they're which they're, is cool, I guess. They're but. taking all the money from me, and then they're they're doing a fucking. The kids lot. are still stupid, but construction is. So they should expensive. be smart. It's How so much tax are they to pay in Sweden? Anything here, what? Swedish kids are smart. <laughs> If we invested a billion dollars to give homeless people juggling balls, yeah, can you imagine that? Like yeah, that? <laughs> it would be a lot more fun. It'd be a, it'd be wow. awesome. That's a good idea. But yeah, let's. I, oh. I think that they're just burning all of our money. Yeah. Send all the homeless to clown college. Oh How much would God. it cost? <laughs> this is getting. This is getting bad. This How much would bad. it cost? I don't know. Probably like less than whatever Fuck solution they're loans. using now, man. But there's only like loans. there's only probably one clown. They're gonna college. be fine. They're probably spending so much money on the homeless Stop. In this crisis. Stop opening homeless shelters. Homeless clown colleges. Yeah. Okay. This will be good for everyone. <laughs> Homeless clown okay. college. All right, clown college. We watched for the Water World right. last I, night. I didn't see this, and also didn't get it invited to watch it. So it doesn't matter. Well, we watched it at poker. Yeah. Well, we it, went it's on a wild. Fucked up. I would have liked to watch it. We can watch you it can, again. I don't want to watch it again. Don't. I wanted to watch it the first time with you guys. Is that not clear? Uh, we didn't have a say in the you matter. You can watch with Andrew. What if? What if? What if you guys went to Disneyland? How do you think this makes Andrew feel? Andrew Andrew has his own life. I don't. <laughs> oh yeah, so that's what we were gonna. Uh, yeah, that is, so we have a we have a comment guy. He might be comment like botting, but he's a good commenter, and he's uh, one of our most famous fans. He's got five thousand followers on YouTube, and he has a YouTube channel that's dedicated to just the Water movie World. Water World. Well, how many views is his max video? Millions. Really? I think he no. Uh, I think he completely dominates the water world corner YouTube. of YouTube. He's like the That's king sick. of water world. He's the leading expert. But w water world's like. Sorry. That's okay. No, no, it's okay. Uh, two hundred sixty k. Two two sixty k. Wow, that's just big. Seven thousand subscribers. Seven k. Damn, his uh put carry through rate on it's not good then. <laughs> but. Anyway, um, yeah. So what's going on over there, Johnny? So he he at? he watches our shit, how, he, and he, he you guys hated his movie that he loves more than anything. I didn't think it was the worst movie ever, it dude. Was, you kept saying that last episode. I was listening every time there was a, a tattoo. You'd go, I don't think it's the worst thing ever. So you need. So you, what is we the need, worst thing ever? Yeah, what is the worst thing ever? It's the worst question. thing ever. <laughs> Just so we can contextualize. Is you guys saying things at the same time. You guys That's talking. That's the worst thing ever. Talking over me. You're not going to make that, idiot. Try it. Oh, that you was suck. way closer than you than you liked. I'm. <laughs> <laughs> it was a little closer than I, I would have liked. I know. But All you right, still didn't make it. Let's go ahead and start over here. Let's what? start fresh. What let's start the podcast about? over. Johnny started with the story of us watching Waterworld and then yeah, Oh, you mean start it. over that segment. That's it. Not start the whole thing over. This, this sucks. Yeah, let's start you the guys whole suck. podcast over. What is wrong with you? Johnny, take some tequila, man. Ever since you got sober, your your nerves are frazzled. I'm just gonna draw some Tay Do lists out. You're gonna put blackface on Taylor Swift again. <laughs> Did we do anything wrong? That I'm never confused. happened. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry. It was when you 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 put her in a straw hat <laughs> and gave her a sword. It was that drawing. I must be misremembering, or maybe right, both right. happened. That didn't happen either. <laughs> okay, well we'll I check the Tay Do list. Look at we'll that check one's the Tay Do list. What's on this one? I wonder. It's an angel. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, did I make it up? Holy moly. Wait, I made it up? No. Which one is that? <laughs> I made it? No, I literally watched. You You colored this. What are the topics on here? No, I made. That means I made. 
I made the run just now. And this is impossible. I made it. This is the worst thing that ever could have happened on this show. You said I wasn't going to make it. I'm giving myself a point. Fuck. It's, that was first try. I never should have looked oh at gosh. blackface Taylor Swift. <laughs> Damn it. It says here, Joa Moist Critical. <laughs> and that's old news. <laughs> Catfish Rodrigo. Yeah, it's true. These episode. are all old topics. It's amazing wow. how many topics you put on this that we don't cover, I don't think, because there's like 20 topics on here. Yeah, some of them suck. Hate Dune 2. Oh, that was when I pretended to hate Dune 2. I, yeah. I remember, <laughs> yeah. All right. Should we uh, should we start over with this water world discussion? Because Okay, kinda... also, I do, though, you need to stop throwing the paper when it's not time to throw the paper because listen anybody can fucking make a free throw when there's no pressure yeah but you cheat you keep this is the second johnny cheating allegation that we've had where he this? throws throw it, it when it's there's no stakes you can throw it when there's no stakes but then you get docked like five attempts when it's real game time or something i don't think you should be able to throw it when there's no stakes at all i think you don't score points before the game starts you start zero zero I, everybody on the clock also, I don't like how your foot is like up there. You're kind of <laughs> giving himself an yeah. advantage. Yeah, yeah. I don't, I don't like this. You just mid show doing the thing we do at the fucking end of the show. Yeah, it's not right. Okay. Okay. Got to stop I'll, that. I'll be better in the future. I'll change. All right, you, you can guys. do your water world review now. I don't. I'm done with water world. Colin can say his. Piece. You didn't even start. Is it will? Is it worth building a channel on? Um, I would say well, no. Well, um, <laughs> it was, Dune it was, was taken. It, it was, was taken. very weird. Yeah, it was a, <laughs> it was like a very bad water version of Mad Max. Oh really? What? Yeah. That's what it is? Yeah, it's yeah, Mad it's Max like on Mad water. Max on water on the but, seas. But literally, Whoa. the the it, the feel of it, and they actually have like water world in Universal Studios where they like acted out on jet skis and stuff. It's like Mad Max on water and it's an actual Universal Studios like show. Attraction. Like a 4D like They they really? Not 4D. What do they call it? Like the acted out. You know they did it at SeaWorld too. A live action show? Yeah, it's like a live action acted out with Whoa. like fire effects. It's like a and- a play. I think they used to yeah, do a that. Play, a play. I don't think they, they do that anymore. I think they might still do. We it. should watch it on YouTube. The Water World? Yeah, the the Water the wa- no, the Waterworld Universal Studios I'm sure production. Eight Tool has a video about it, probably. I'd probably. like to see it. But I mean, basically the what? funny thing the ultimate the funny thing about the the Water World thing is that we put it on and it's like famous for being like a big massive box office flop. It's that's what the movie's like super known for. Mm-hmm. It's a Kevin Costner movie and it's like his biggest bust. It's probably super expensive to make. Yeah, it? it looks expensive as hell to make and it ultimately kind of fucking sucked. And the whole movie, <laughs> my dad was kind of drunk. He just kind of keeps his head down when he plays poker and we were kind of talking about the movie and he would kind of chime in every once in a while. He go Water world. Oh, this movie fucking sucks. Like <laughs> he was just talking shit on the movie, like grumbling about it and saying this is the worst movie ever. Like, like, yeah, and then just, it turns out the guy that's to my left, who's kind of a is, is like a the dude who runs the YouTube channel. A, yeah, <laughs> he's basically the atoll. He's like a brother-in-law of one of the guys that we play with. He's a huge Water World fan, and he didn't say anything the entire time. <laughs> While we were all just sitting there shitting on the movie. How did you find out that he likes Waterworld? Later on, he, he... He got the courage? He got the courage, yeah. He said, well, I've seen it like five times. And I... Cause, you, what is it okay, about we Waterworld that We were does trying that to, to figure out how the Atoll became a Waterworld guy. And we, we decided that it, he probably owned like three VHSs. And Waterworld was the coolest out of the three. Mm. He probably, and he he probably, probably watched, watched it, it 47 times or something when he was like 12. Because we all did that with yeah. you know, the, I the think VHS he, that he watched he, over and over. He probably watched Waterworld at like seven, age seven. And it kind of was like Just like burned thing. into his brain like that image of the, the Filipino lady with yeah. fake boobs <laughs> yeah. online. Exactly. Got yes. It. Yeah. Like, I was really into Greece. I haven't showed you guys yeah, my Filipino lady with fake boobs YouTube channel yet. Donnie was into Greece. I, I really liked the musical Greece. That's, that's with John different, Travolta. though. 
That's yeah. a fucking classic. That's yeah. that's like even to adults who watch that, they revered that movie. Yeah, but I like watched it a what lot, I, like every what's week. The that's char- normal. What's the character's name that I have? Like I said, I had a weird thing with. Oh yeah, uh, I don't, I don't remember weird her name, thing? but it's Sandy's, Sandy's friend. She goes baby Sandy. voice, and I like. <laughs> I remember when I was a kid, I was like, I hate this, but I like it. <laughs> I really, she has like a mousy voice. I was the right age oh. where I was really, really into it, but I also just fucking hated it at the same time. I couldn't get enough of that chick. You. Yeah. You've always liked the abusive ones, eh? Yeah. Colin? No. Yep. Um. <laughs> <laughs> um. Oh my God. That was funny. So, uh, yeah, Grease is a great movie. Waterworld. Not so great. Also really it's basically the entire Drift. movie is it's so it's an ap- post flood, uh, like apocalypse land, mm. mm-hmm. and he just keeps on sailing. And every like thirty minutes, the same evil guys start chasing after him again. The smokers, and they're, yeah, they're called the smokers. <laughs> they, they go, smoke. "What's that?" They're they're about to figure something out. They go, "What's that?" Oh, the smokers are here, and then they somehow <laughs> defeat them with they're like jet a harpoon. Ski pirates. He the somehow smokers. he outplays them with only wind and a harpoon like eight times. Wow, it's pretty cool. And, uh, so what? What is? But I'm I'm curious. Like, because oh, no, the, there's two people now that we know they're huge fans of this like shitty movie. I think it's got to be they so, saw it at a young. Well, I don't know about no. The I there has guy. to be something about the movie that people are obsessed it's, with. Well, the chick's kind of hot. Is she? <laughs> Kinda. In like a nineteen ninety five kind of way. Uh, yeah, it was. She's all right. Do you know who's in it that I saw? There's a a a woman, and then there's a a younger gal, and she's a woman the and girl her daughter. from um, Napoleon, Napoleon Dynamite. Dynamite. Deb. Yeah, Deb. As Whoa, a child. She's in it? Yeah. Deb's in it. Joe's not even looking for the hot chick in Waterworld. He's just I, I looked Instagram. and now now I went on Instagram after right after. Whoa. Yeah, you're like it wasn't doing that's it for crazy. You. That happened fast. I realized after I opened, I looked up Waterworld images that I I didn't want to see. <laughs> I re- I I was like I don't want to know what Waterworld looks like really, because I don't know and there's been so much talk about it that I don't think I ever want to know. I kind of like having it be this image that's... in my mind. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's a bunch of white people <laughs> with uh, braided hair and dreadlocks, <laughs> and uh, there's only water, really. And dirt and plants are the just most expensive current. They're the ultimate currency. Mm-hmm. The only sure. currency is just plants. And pure hydro. That's what they call water. <laughs> hydro? Pure, like, drinking water. There's a big like uh, smoking uh, theme to it. Hydro and smokers. Mm. Yeah, and then at the end of the movie, they're, so they're, they don't know where land is. Like, it's just this... Uh, they call it dry land. Yeah, dry land. And at they're the end, they find land. it, because it turns out that this little girl had a map to it on Tattooed her back on her for back. some reason. They oh, find dry land. Fuck. And it's, it's Hawaii. It's Hawaii. <laughs> there really? just turns out there's just this lush, dry <laughs> yeah, land. It's beautiful. And it's Hawaii. They just mm. There was Hawaii the whole time, <laughs> but nobody could fucking find it. Sucks so bad. Wow. So you guys have no idea what people like about the movie? If there was only one island on Earth, I guess it would be pretty hard to find it. If there's only one little island. (laughs) Yeah, it'd be hard as fuck. If Hawaii was just... It'd be so hard. But if you had a whole lifetime... Dude, I couldn't even find Hawaii right now. I couldn't even... I probably... You underestimate yourself, fool. You could find Hawaii. (laughs) Thanks. Thank you, actually. But we I, should do a world genius sales to Hawaii without, survival challenge. Yeah, I watched it. just us and revolution. Mm-hmm. Yeah, revolutions and pure hydro. I got Joe into revolution. I fucking went kicking and screaming. Yeah, he but really was fighting it at first. It was so but. annoying. He's so <laughs> annoying, and then I I started craving it. Yeah, I started. Yeah. That's that you one like song. Revolution? Yeah. What's that song you guys are always having fun to? Yeah. It's, uh, uh, who got the up, man? I'm dry. I'm, I'm trying to get, get so high. high. Yeah, that song. 
I'm a fiend for the greens, chicky leaves. Yeah, I want to get high. It's the whole thing. It's really good. So, I, the first time I heard it, I was like, this is so fucking stupid. It sounds like a freestyle. Mm-hmm. Like that an actual pothead could come, like a, yeah. li- a sort a lightly skilled pothead could come up with. Yeah. yeah. But it just well, has bang in production. And that's why we like it. And I can't, I can't get enough of it. Mm-hmm. Sometimes you got to let go and, and let, let go. revolution... Take control of your mind. Jobless. Yeah. I hope reggae makes a full comeback. That would be cool. Dude, yeah. remember Snoop Lion tried to fucking ride the wave? Yeah, what was... an embarrassing rebrand for that dumbass. Whoa, man. What? <laughs> I agree. <laughs> Snoop Dogg is fucking so damn corny. Dude, the I'm fucking sorry. fact he did that I'm quitting smoke thing mm. and for the... Pff, He's like an. He's, we talked about sorry, but you only get you ad, only get yeah. one. Yeah, you only get quitting. one. You can't quit now. When you quit weed, I'm not gonna believe you. He boy who cried wolfed weed. Boy who cried, I quit yeah. weed. Yeah, that was bullshit. He's an asshole. I don't care about him anymore. We after were all that. sitting at the edge of our seats for weeks. Because it was like it was a big deal. It was a cultural fucking, and then he sold out on his fucking quitting weed moment. I thought it was the end of weed as we knew it. <laughs> But it almost felt appropriate at the time too. I was like, like I was like, oh my god, this is the final nail in the coffin for weed because weed's been <laughs> kind of dogs quitting. Nobody really gives a shit about weed anymore. Weed used to be cool. Like yeah. if you were smoking weed on Instagram, it was do like kid, badass. Do TikTok kids even smoke weed? Nobody knows. I don't even think TikTok kids smoke weed. I don't see any kids smoking weed. No, online. they're all they've all got carts and shit. You know. They're, 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 uh, you think? Yeah, they've all got I feel like stizzies. they just vape and drink. No, I think we're in a vaping and no, drinking they got stizzies, era. man. They're getting stoned for sure. Really? Remember 420? That that guy, the uh, the fulcrum guy? That guy fell off so hard. Yeah, he and, did. And I, I knew, th- dude. Blinkerton? I remember the remember? fucking day that that guy got popular because I was doing a stream and there were like four people saying the dumbest shit <laughs> in the... They're like, bro. I don't. They were like, oh, Mister Streamington is on or something. I was like, what is this? Like, what are you guys talking about? This is so whack. And then they like, I found out what Fulcrum was, and then I was like, this is n- so annoying and not going to last long at all. Yeah. And I then don't even it know didn't. what this is. You don't know what Fulcrum is? No. Johnny, what does he say? Say what he says. Uh. Fulcrum, come in. Yodi gang. Yodi ga- oh, yeah, gang. Yodi gang. Oh, Yodi gang. gang. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And he would, he would go, I'm, I'm going to Blinkerton. You want to hit this and go to Blinkerton? Pen- I'm hitting the Benjamin yeah. to Blinkerton. It was like n- just yeah, so super, fucking super average. Funny. Very funny, actually. Nah, don't like that. Very, <laughs> Thank very you, funny, Colin. Actually. I don't like I feel like I have a fucking ally at last. No, with Colin in the room. <laughs> no, 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 no you do, you, you do. I'm just saying, I don't, I don't like this stuff. It reminds me of like uh, <sighs> East Coast stoners. You know? Ew, I hate East Coast everything. Yeah, West Coast for life, ho. <laughs> West exactly, Coast till exactly. I die. People keep telling me to move. Like you got to get out of Cali, bro. I'm like, that's like that's a person who doesn't get to live in Cali saying that shit. They're like, They're come, like dude, this... come, come toil with me. Come suffer over come here in the rain. We, yeah, come to fucking, New Mexico. We can make it through the winter <laughs> together. Yeah. New Mexico is so the rude. worst. Come oh to New Mexico gosh. and get stabbed. What are you drawing over I there? Had, I had fantasies I'm turning, of... Uh, her into Bob Marley. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I, I had like a fantasy where I was going to move to the Rhode Island or the East Coast somewhere, and then I went to Rhode Island... For a couple of weeks, yeah. my buddy lives out there, and I was like, "The sun just don't hit like no. it's doing Cali." No. Like no, there's like an don't. orange film over your reality. I like, think there's you're like, two you're weeks. Like, eh, you're kind of squinting. You're like, "This is, is pretty, but I can't even. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm looking at. Like, like what is this yeah. shit?" Yeah, nice to. And visit. then you come back to California, and you're like, "Oh my god, I see. I see in 4K, <laughs> and everything's so much better here." Yeah. Yeah. Two, there's like two weeks a year on the East Coast that are really, really nice. I'm just, my body just, anytime I leave California, my body just starts freaking out after like two days. <laughs> like my, it's, the air is either too dry. I, lo- I love or... leaving Cali. I love leaving, but coming back, I'm like, thank God, man. 
Thank God. Going to Arizona. Sometimes I go to Arizona for a weekend and it's too much. You know, just be in Tempe. You guys been to Tempe? You've been to Tempe. Yeah. Yeah, you played baseball in Tempe, right? <laughs> I watched baseball in Tempe. <laughs> watched. You didn't even get to play? I was watching professional baseball. Oh, oh, I thought you played Little League in Tempe. <laughs> no, I went oh. to spring training. Oh, what the fuck? Is that it's fun? It's like preseason baseball. Well, preseason baseball is kind of cool, actually, because... Uh, they all have like little stadiums in Arizona. Uh, right, Half, right. The, all the West Coast teams are in Arizona. All the East Coast teams are in Florida. Why the hell would they but go to all Tempe like, to play baseball? That's where just where the Angels uh, team is. They're all over. They're in like Scottsdale has a team all over the Phoenix area. Mm. But it's kind of it's kind of lit because you can go see the prospects and uh, it's baseball fan shit, man. Mm-hmm. But it's cheap and it's chill. Johnny. You're pissing me off, man. Like Peter. Peter's great. Peter, Peter's great. You're not Peter. locked baseball in. Baseball Peter. You know baseball Peter. I know baseball Peter. Me and Peter play fantasy I'm baseball. Lo- oh, I'm locked in all right. Johnny used to get drunk on this podcast, and now he gets high and draws. Sorry, I'm a creative. I can't help it. You're a it's creative? just what happens. Yeah. Hate that. I think, what, what kind of hairstyle would you give Johnny if you could change him? I was thinking about cutting my hair today. Yeah? It's like, now that I'm a big buff guy. Once you get buff, you're like, the hair's in the way from my body. It's blocking my my, my yeah. back muscles. Mm-hmm. Yeah. What mm-hmm. would we give him? I should get a faux hawk, probably. Like a classic. <laughs> I would love to see you with short hawk. hair. Some thick dreads. Uh, I could get dreads. That would be kind of cool. I think you should dye it. Blonde. I think you go blonde. He'd be nah. so unlikable. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Thanks. Oh man. All right, Andrew. How long have we been fucking going for, man? Uh, I'm pulling up something right now. Okay. Is it a which truck are you quiz? Bingo. <laughs> <laughs> Job bless, Andrew. Okay, guys, we're moving into the main event here, it sounds like. Yes, the re- what truck are you, Quiz? Uh, the exact one I found myself. Oh, oh boy. boy. What kind of truck are you? Who's t- All right, we're doing it three times. Who's going first? <laughs> all right. We all have to agree, okay? I was thinking we could all be a truck together. Can you zoom in? <laughs> oh, there's only like eight questions, though. Okay, yeah, we're doing so it. We eight. Can we're do doing this it three, three times. times. Four, maybe. If Andrew wants to be a truck. Wow. What? The feature that makes a kick-ass truck. Ooh. Power. <laughs> what what are all the bells and whistles? That's um, got like uh like, it's like a sound uh, system. Plugs. <laughs> it's got a sound system. Like it's got plugs. Leather in it. seats. Yeah. Plugs. Oh, plugs in it, you know. Yeah, but that why don't you you could get a minivan if that's what you're after. They, uh, this but you also want a truck top a hundred times. I feel like it's four wh- wheel drive. I'm going to say, for you want me to go first, or uh, who wants to go first? You go first. I'll go first. Uh, versatility. Should I just call four of these? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just caught. Yeah, yeah. That's perfect. That's a good idea. That's a perfect, good idea. Perfect, perfect. Does this look like Bob Marley? Yes. Andrew? Yeah. She looks a little, little pale. Just Bob. like Bob Marley. Right, Colin, we got a joint. Yeah, I'm. I'm gonna go with. Uh, I'm gonna go with power. Yeah, I'll take power. I was, I was thinking about going with power. You can wow. go power too. You should pick a different one because I picked power. I'm going bells and whistles. <laughs> nice. All right, that's a good one. So Johnny, you got power without. Wait, I was power though. You guys can both be power. You just can't follow the <laughs> okay, same. Okay, what's the best way to break the ice with someone you've just met? How does that have to do with being? <laughs> what does that have to do with being a truck? <laughs> Uh, tell, a, right. tell a filthy story. I'm not telling a filthy joke. <laughs> no, that's disgusting. Colin doesn't do that. Ask about. Oh, I'll probably tell him about myself. <laughs> uh, I'll probably tell him about myself too, if I'm honest. Sometimes I forget to ask people questions. Be honest, like Johnny. Is this me? Yeah. Um, I'll tell him about myself. Sure. You fucking copycat pig. Okay, so I have a, when I meet new people, I have questions that I use to make sure like, if they're cool or not. Mm. Or if they do, they'll do with me. So I went to this one festival and I would like, 
be waiting in line and I'd whisper like, hey, I found a dirty mag in the bushes over there. <laughs> you, get, you down for later? So I think I'm going to go with filthy jokers. Wow. Okay. Wow. <laughs> That's how I That's one of my crazy. Best friends, actually. That's <laughs> insane. Jesus Christ. Uh, is Colin? Uh, Colin. Yeah, Colin. Well, I live with my girlfriend, and she's relatively neat, but I'm probably in the messy. Not sexy. Sexy. My <laughs> room is sexy. I have a sexy room. It's not a. I can't house, stop either. fucking my couch. Uh, just put neat. Or uh, no, I'll just go with messy. No, to be it's honest. messy. Your room is messy. If it was just yours. Yeah, if it was just my room, you're right. Hit me with biohazard. And yeah. <laughs> Mine it's my car messy. that's the biohazard. My room's not bad. Mine's messy. Johnny's got messy. Johnny's room is sexy. It has cheetah print carpet. It is good. It's messy. Yeah. We make it messy. But Johnny just copies what everyone else does. He just wants to fit in. He <laughs> smokes weed all he day wants, now and doesn't he wants fucking to be think in the anymore. Same truck as us. <laughs> I'm a <laughs> so bad. I'm a fiend for the green sticky leaves. Man, I'm getting so high. <laughs> okay. Well, <laughs> Colin. You walk into a rental car place and are confronted with zero truck choices. Oh, this is for truck fans. What kind fans. of car do you choose? Oh, man. This is hard. Oh, you could leave the rental place and go find a truck somewhere else? <laughs> choose another. Uh, I'd go comfort. Something comfortable? Mm. You like the luxury? I mean, if it's a rental car, fast is kind of cool. Yeah. I was Fuck! Fast. Whoa, it's look fun. at her. Oh, uh, yeah. you, uh, <laughs> I'm gonna go. Yes, please. I wanna be her coworker. <laughs> <laughs> I know how those cops get down. <laughs> Is that gonna be your new, uh, your new uh, work girlfriend, Colin? I'm going to work wifey. In. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna go with. Uh, I'll take. Why would I? And I don't want economical on the rental. I I I want something. I'll I want something fast. I think I'll go fast. Damn it. Yeah, <laughs> I'm going fast. Fuck oh, you, are man. You have such fast cars compared to mine now. <laughs> I'm so fucked. All right. I miss the lady sheriff. All right. When you get the itch to travel, how do you decide where you're going to go? <laughs> Okay. Extensive research, I'm going to say. Uh, yeah. Um, I'll just... Uh, I, I look for adventure and it. go there. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I do. Dude. I look for adventure and go there. Really good answer. What do you do, Johnny? <laughs> I look for adventure and I go there. <laughs> dude, you suck, man. <laughs> Fucking copying me all the time, Okay, man. Andrew wanders aimlessly until he, <laughs> that's what he put in that's for cool. the audio that's listeners. True. Oh, yeah, sorry, sorry. Dude, fuck the audio listeners. Fuck those if your motherfuckers. your high stress, normal stress, low stress, oh, is your, oh, sorry, is your job <laughs> high stress, normal stress, low stress. This guy's freaking out. Or no stress. Uh, <laughs> fuck. I'll say normal. Depends on what day it is, you know. <laughs> no, he, it's Sunday. <laughs> it's Sunday. <laughs> I'd say high stress. I got a high stress job, <laughs> dude. When you get that fucking tax bill from Gavin, mine's, it's not chill. Mine's normal. You can call normal it whatever you want. Yeah. You can. Andrew's low stress. stress. Okay. That's sick. What's your prized possession as a kid? My pet. That's weird to think of it your as a pet. possession. Okay, that might be my answer, but that is weird. <laughs> um, I don't think it's a good one. Uh, not your pet's bike. not your pos possession. But out of these things, don't. I did like my dog Smokey more than a trophy. <laughs> 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 or I'm gonna say my pet. I don't. I don't think whoever wrote this like quiz is like really intelligent enough to make distinctions between like you know what possession really means. A cool toy. Um, 
a cool toy. I'll, I'll go my favorite stuffed animal. <laughs> Which one? But Teddy, I still have him. Wow. That's... Oh, we need to do this fast because... I, well, pet is just kind of cheating because I do care about my pets more hurry, than Johnny. any of these you things. You don't care about your pet. I have pet. to go to the bathroom. You okay, need pet. To hurry up. Just do pet. Hurry, please. Out of the choices. Is copying you or he's co- he's... Johnny hasn't had an original answer on this fucking thing, man. Cool toy. Cool toy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Is an El Camino a truck or a car? It's an embarrassment. <laughs> uh, fuck. To me, that's a car. <laughs> I I tend to agree with Colin. I, I would classify it as a car. Yeah, it's a truck, man. That's a truck? It's got a truck bed. You call that a truck? It's got a truck bed. <laughs> That's not a truck. It's an embarrassment. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Before you before you hit it, wait, let's wait for Joe to get back. Because that would make no sense if he wasn't here for it. Okay. So, guys, right, so we're back. We all peed. We peed. I actually, I actually like let out. I I thought I was gonna have an insane dump, and there were just four four bunny p- pellets in there. Literally, I don't, don't want to know, man. <laughs> well, you don't want to know what I did to your toilet. No, you know what I do to your toilet every I know time I you come do. over. Yeah. So what difference does it make if I, I tell you? Talk about it, <laughs> Let's look at these trucks, man. Folks, all right, up all right. The trucks. Well, what do you think you got? What? Oh uh, gosh. Uh, like a Toyota Tundra in 2009 <laughs> that has like sun damage on the roof. <laughs> right, get result. No, <laughs> no, 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 <laughs> no, 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 man. Why the is that fuck? all there is there? Can you not scroll down more? What? <laughs> What happened? No, no, no. <laughs> what happened? All right. Okay, I'm cutting. I'm cutting. What? No. Oh, man. What? How could they do this to us? <laughs> no, don't put your real do email, it. man. No, 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 this is my uh, oh, my gosh. So, for the audio listeners, we, we clicked get results. And keep in mind, we did this on four different tabs. It says, before you get your results, take oh a quiz. Oh, my God, God, man. This is so wrong. And Andrew's oh, having to... to oh. <laughs> <laughs> and now Andrew's having to give his personal information. Did you see there was, like, a, a politician that was considered... <laughs> oh, <are> you... <laughs> what All is right. that, man? I'm a tow truck. Wow, oh that's so cool. Gosh. Hell, yeah. Dude, congratulations, man. Thanks, man. Thanks, guys. Utilitarian. <laughs> you should call in your new thing, and you can say it. Funny. I sexually identify as a tow truck. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, here we uh, go. Here we go. Uh, what am I? <laughs> what am I? Turkey. You're doing it again, Andrew. Why are you doing it again? <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Can I see mine, though? <laughs> I'm a fire oh! truck. <laughs> Yay, I'm a fire truck. What <laughs> kind of truck are you? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Johnny's a tow truck. Uh, you would have the same one oh as going. God. No way! And you got a monster truck. What didn't didn't you pick something economical at the car <laughs> rental place? <laughs> Fucking monster truck! <laughs> There's oh. no way. Oh, oh, oh! Uh, what uh, garbage uh, truck? <laughs> I I thought these were gonna be like <laughs> models of pickup yeah, trucks, I not I like a Ford different Raptor. different utility like fucking vehicles. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Damn, Andrew wins. Yeah, Andrew. Won. Actually, I don't. What? Well, who would win in a fight? A fire truck or a, a monster, monster truck? Monster truck, man. Really? I have a hose, though. I'm like, I'm, fire trucks are really big. Are you gonna clean the monster truck, bro, with your hose? <laughs> I might, I might blow his windshield out with a, my my hose. Well, yeah. you have to consider that there's two tro- t- two tow trucks that are down to throw down too. <laughs> yeah, the tow we'll truck just pick you guys shit. up, and yeah. you can't yeah. be able to do I'll anything. Get the fr- no way, I'll get dude. the front. I'll get the you back. can't even tow a fire we'll truck. They're too apart. big. Yeah, you can. Look up, uh, look up fire oh, really? truck dimensions. 
There's dude. Oh, this I I was driving. I didn't notice a fire truck was behind me on the road like yesterday. I wasn't like, on my phone or anything either. I was listening to techno music, driving, and I was like, I feel like I kind of hear like sirens. <laughs> And like 30 seconds past, and I look in my rear view, and there's a fire truck that is just so pissed behind me. And I'm all the way in the left. And I like, I like, and I'm like, oh shit. And I'm on this massive road, and I just go like, turn like four lanes over to the right in a Prius, just like, I can imagine like the, all the fire dudes in the truck, like, what the fuck? Like, who's in, like, I don't know. It's like a all that curb episode. Of money being pissed at you. Yeah. Yeah, but that was that was like a r- certified like geriatric moment. It was bizarre. I like somehow my brain just tuned out like a a fire truck behind me. Pretty crazy. Um, oh, a standard a standard pumper fire truck typically measures between twenty eight and thirty two feet in length, nine feet in width, and. 11 to 13 feet in height. That's crazy. Dang. That's the exact dimensions of my dick. Okay, pussy. <laughs> Typically measures around 50 to 55 feet in length. All right, that's badass. <laughs> Fire trucks are huge. <laughs> yeah. Smaller. <laughs> Smaller, but cool. Type monster in truck monster is the- fire truck. Ooh. Monster. Ooh. Monster tow truck. Ooh. Monster tow truck. Ooh. Mo- oh. Whoa. <laughs> That's Whoa. a crane truck? Monster truck with a crane on it? Wow. That's cool. Dimensions. You can't s- just sit over well, there. Well, just Andrew, just block it out. It's good. We'll put a big rectangle. Go to, in- go to images. <laughs> go to images. <laughs> okay, let's see. Whoa, this dude! Is that cool. one. What is that? The the Halloween one. T- what, what what do you call that one? The grave, grave digger. digger. Oh, oh, here we go. Here we go. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> wow. That's we, a that thumbnail awesome. alert, Andrew. <laughs> we thumbnail should, and alert. Called, and the episode's called Jug World and a <laughs> fire truck. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, uh, that's best episode funny. ever. That's oh, funny, man. man. We need to do a DIY monster truck. Yeah, yeah, that's what we need to do. We should turn my van, van my tiny van, into a I monster think, truck. I think we could. I What's that one could. on the left, that YouTube thumbnail there? What is it? Okay, it's just fake. That is cool. No, that's real. That's Dude, all really we big, though. We just need to... We'll take my sheet metal snips, and we'll just kind of cut around the tires so we can fit eight wow, feet tires nice. on it. That's cool. That's so awesome. Can we watch monster truck videos, maybe, perhaps? Monster truck videos, nice. Whoa! Look at all the how naked about, guys on my how YouTube. About, like, tow truck compilation. San Diego freestyle. Yeah, San Diego freestyle. Dude, we're just, Wait, there's a bus right there. Monster trucks events just happen all the time, and you never, you never know anything about mm-hmm. it. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. yeah when I was should. a kid. Whoa! Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, oh. it is, it's a fire monster truck. We so should definitely cool. be... wait. That's a fire truck. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Wow, that's what we were looking for. <laughs> we should definitely be watching something that's it's brought like to you some... by Great Clips. Whoa! Wow! <laughs> I want him to do a flip really bad. Guys, this is... Oh yeah! This guy's not that good. He's no grave digger. Oh, yeah. <laughs> He's playing it safe. He's a fire truck. This is better in double speed. <laughs> Do you think? Wow! Like, oh, like, oh, no. oh no! 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 He's dead. <laughs> the guy died. <laughs> <Is it> smoking. <laughs> that kind of looked like Whoa. a. Holy! This, what? Yes. In his arms. <laughs> he did it in the truck. Okay, that's mine. I want a toy of that one. Oh, can Dad. we do a what monster truck are you quiz? Okay, that's good. All right, all right. I like yeah, you guys aren't going go. anywhere. <laughs> yeah, we're doing. A lot more. <laughs> can we? Can we make sure you don't have to do a survey after this one? Uh, no, we'll we'll do a survey if we have to. Well, all the good ones have surveys at the end. Here we go. What monster? Oh man, 
Can't believe you guys both got tow truck. That's so lame. It was cool when I got it, but then when Johnny got it. <laughs> yeah, it was cool when you got it. Johnny's not a tow truck. Not, I, that That's why it was lame. Because yeah, you're just not a tow truck, man. I'm more of a George Clooney and Brad Pitt in Ocean's Eleven. <laughs> <laughs> tow truck. Both if you had to pick just one aspect of Monster Jam as your favorite, what would it be? Dude, this uh, question is so dumb. Just it, the whole show. It asks for one aspect and then says uh, the whole show. That's well, just not I'm the freestyle. Because <laughs> the races are bullshit. I'll go into I'm, that I'm, later. <laughs> you know, let's do yeah, okay. let's do Colin. Okay. Is there a particular design that you like? Yeah. Um, <laughs> I like character designs, I think. I, I Oh, crazy 3D designs. <laughs> I, I, sorry, I really like that zombie. <laughs> <laughs> uh, have you, you ever had a chance to sit inside a Monster Jam truck? No, I wish. I wish. Spider Man. Just say a couple. <laughs> <laughs> have you? Yeah, I've been to a couple. Uh. <laughs> Oh man! Uh, Jesus! You're Formula na- One, you, I guess. You're not a NASCAR <laughs> guy. No. no. Monster Jam is packed full of tricks, but which is your favorite? Oh fuck! What do you even know Ooh. what a moonwalk is, noob? Sounds so cool though. <laughs> uh, Nose wheelies. All right, I'm, I'm a backflip guy. I'm not even a fucking afraid to admit it. <laughs> <laughs> let's, say, let's say you're debuting as a Monster Jam driver. Which song are you rolling out to? Oh man, uh, wow. <laughs> dude, the the thunder monster. I already know what they're talking about. That thunder. I'm, I'm gonna say thunderstruck just because I the want that one. answer. <laughs> you want to be that? I one? want that truck. This looks long. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I feel like you just sell more at racing or freestyle. I'm more of a freestyler. <laughs> <laughs> What's more exciting to you? Dude, uh, the, crowd. Says, the one, crowd. One tends to lead to the other. The crowd. <laughs> oh, one tends to lead to the other. But... <laughs> Whoa. What, what the other, fuck? What sports entertainment do you get into? Uh, Roller Derby. <laughs> Roller Derby, no way. Uh, the, do the Harlem Globetrotters count? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, is is that little thing on the right, the little scroll thing, is that how many questions there are? Like, scroll? Mm-hmm. Oh, all right, we're just doing Collins. All right. Yeah, we're, we're just, just doing, doing Collins. <laughs> you, guys, you guys are all jealous of my answers anyways. Yeah, your answers have all been what I would say so far. I'm the only monster truck here. <laughs> That's true. That's true. Should we just be a team for the rest of this? Were you into monster trucks before Monster Jam? Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 this one's funny. Uh, the answers are so good. Uh, Some drivers have been doing this for decades. Do you have a favorite? Uh, I don't know any. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a Tom Meats kind of guy. Oh, oh man. Oh. No. <laughs> There's no no answer. Oh my god. Uh, depends on what's happening. <laughs> <laughs> Such a stupid answer. <laughs> well, it's true. I'm standing and screaming regardless of the situation. <laughs> if somebody's dying. <laughs> <laughs> you cheer for the death at the monster truck event. Oh. When the monster fire truck comes out <laughs> to save the... Total goofball. I can be goofy. <laughs> Most right. you want a side of weird. Uh, put total goof. No, because <laughs> okay, I don't want to think about what I'm gonna get. I'm a total goofball. <laughs> <laughs> when you walk into the party, does everybody know your name? The right people do. <laughs> 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 Can you be scary? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. 
Uh. Are you the kind of person who likes to play it safe, or do you throw caution to the wind? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Mm-hmm. What do you guys think? I, I guess I play it safe for the most part. You're not totally wild. I'm not wild. Uh, not totally wild. I uh, I strike a balance. I'm gonna say. <laughs> Good answer. Good answer, Colin. Just Good being answer. honest. Just being honest. Trying to get the right monster truck. <laughs> <laughs> dogs are man's best friend, but what about dog trucks? Which one's your favorite? <laughs> oh shit! Oh uh, gosh. What's oh, monster mode? So cool. Scooby Doo's on uh, yeah, there. Yeah, I kind of want to go with Scooby Doo. <laughs> How could you not do Scooby Doo? Let's say you have your own monster truck. What do you want to run over the most? Ooh. An, a school bus. It's gonna what be a. Fuck? It's gonna be a school bus. <laughs> Dude, the only answer was cop car, bro. Cop car, yeah, man. Oh, a cab, bro. <laughs> oh come on. <laughs> I'm not gonna oh, go there on. right now. <laughs> Uh, watching football. Swag. No questions asked. When you're behind the wheel, do you ever push it to see how fast you can go? Uh, I have maybe once or twice. <laughs> Where should an engine be in a monster truck anyways? Front. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Oh, there's that guy. Yeah, there he is. We'll watch that later. Are you the kind of person who likes to make a scene and get noticed? Uh, when I'm in the right mood. <laughs> That's the splits, the mood to do the splits. Yeah. What's your opinion of <laughs> <laughs> Oh, man, that's a good fucking... Yeah, it's great pretty cat. cool. Robosaurus. It's is, pretty cool. Yeah, Robosaurus. I'm a big fan. <laughs> I've just found out about him, but I'd say I'm a fan. It's pretty cool. Yeah, yeah. it's pretty cool. <laughs> Sometimes. <laughs> Is it better to win or have a good time? Mm, have a good time. Wow. Ow. Monster, truck, uh, monster jam trucks take heavy damage all the time. Are you handy enough to fix things on the fly? Yes. <laughs> I'm pretty handy. Some people are quiet and some are loud. What about you? Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, this I is a keep fucking slog, it at whatever man. volume is necessary. You can't make a monster truck without a body. Who makes the best trucks? Oh fuck! I'm gonna say I'm gonna just guess, but I'm gonna go with Dodge. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> you want Dodge? Oh, oh you you're Max, Max D. D. Yay! <laughs> Back in the day, maximum destruction was bored. Can you zoom in, Andrew? I really wanted to be the lightning one. Was born as a tie-in to the WCW, known as Goldberg. So this truck was forged in toughness and badassery. That's cool. As Max D, it has continued a tradition of being one of the coolest trucks on the circuit and also one of the trucks that proved these monsters can do backflips. Max D defies expectations. Oh, he's a big backflipper. I f- yeah, I feel like you just answered backflip and mm-hmm. then it answered completely based off that. Look at the spikes on it. Okay, can Very cool. Andrew, can you... Can you go in on the uh, I'm not new gonna tab lie. I, and I type in I don't think that monster truck's that cool. A Max D toy. I don't think you got the get coolest one. that's one. like $200 and put it on the World Genius oh, okay. credit card. <laughs> that thing that sucks. sucks. I want a realism Bad. one. Make, type in model car. One that we can paint ourselves. Okay. I don't think the Max D fandom is very strong. Yeah, this is not a good car to be. I'm yeah, I think you car. got a bad answer. Can, just out of curiosity, can you type in Monster Jam Thunder sh- Thunder Car? What's it called? Thunderstruck? <laughs> Thunder. <laughs> Let's uh, see Thundersaurus. No, it's not Thundersaurus. It's a black one with blue thunder on it. Sounds that cool. One was wow. Cool. Thing that thing is. Okay, never mind. That one's cooler. <laughs> It's Look got teeth. That. <laughs> My God. <clears throat> I don't know. Uh, dinosaur themed monster trucks is kind of like a seven year old vibe. Do you guys want to do yours and then I just cut to the answer? No. no. <laughs> <laughs> Hell no. I'd rather just all right. stop. We're all max speed. <laughs> all right. I think that's I think that's good for one episode. Gang, what do you think? We should see if we can yeah, make ourselves yeah. grave digger. <laughs> 
<laughs> try to engineer it. <laughs> what would Gravedigger say about this? All right, guys. Thank you for watching. Shout out everybody that's on the Patreon. Oh, also, I should say my sincerest apologies to Ranch Spirits. I got drunk and said fuck Ranch Spirits on a live stream on Instagram. I didn't mean it, obviously. I love Ranch Spirits, and I hope when we come over to record an episode, there's no beef, and if there is, we're going to have to squash that shit because Ranch Spirits isn't going anywhere, and neither is World Genius, so we might as well you know, stay in business together and build something beautiful. That's very big of you, Phil. So true. That's very big of you, and I'm sure all the foos at Ranch Spirits will really appreciate that. They're not foos at Ranch Spirits. You got a bunch of They're whites kind of there. There's some people that aren't white. Mm -hmm. Really? Mm -hmm. But do they keep them in the back? Because I never seen them. Mm -hmm. you're, doing, <laughs> you're, just you're doing the, doing thing, the again. thing again. What? Where I make a joke <laughs> at their expense? Yeah. <laughs> Oopsie. <laughs> Great. All All right. That was funny. <laughs> All right. It seems like they don't like it when I'm funny, is what I'm trying to think so. Yeah. Thank you. Holy shit. But you know, the world is, do you guys remember that guy who would 